Thanks for following along on our adventures. If you'd like to plan a magic vacation of your own, please subscribe to our channel and reach out to us on Facebook at Paul and Ashley Magic Vacation Planners. All right, we are back. We are uh, down at the pool. Uh, kids are in the hot tub. My man Paxson's enjoying a french fry. And I got some uh, wings and a nice cold Sam Adams. Got actually some rosé. Um, watching the Bills and Lions game. So shaping up to be a good Thanksgiving. We got reservations at Trattoria Al Forno later. So we will uh, be enjoying our time at the pool uh, for as much as we can before we go back to the room and uh, get ready and head out. He's at the hot tub. All right, all right, all right. Our time at the pool has come to an end. Glasses are all watery. I'm gonna head back to the room. We're all gonna shower. And we are going to head to Disney Springs. No, scratch that. Heading to the boardwalk. And we're having dinner at Trattoria Al Forno. We had reservations at Disney Springs at Homecoming. But we also have reservations for the fireworks cruise at um, Magic Kingdom. So we got to be at the Contemporary. What time do we have to be the Contemporary? Between 6.30, 6.45. And dining reservations were like at 5.30 at Homecoming. So there's absolutely no way we were going to be able to make our reservation at Homecoming to get to the fireworks cruise on time. So how much time was that for? Unfortunately, we need to cancel our homecoming reservation and uh, we were able to snag one at Trattoria Al Forno um, a little earlier. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to have some Italian for Thanksgiving. I'm not even sure if they're going to have like a Thanksgiving meal, but it doesn't even matter. Yeah, they, it's a great restaurant, great food. And it's Thanksgiving, we're in Florida. We're just happy to be here. So I don't care what I'm eating. Uh, I had buffalo wings for lunch for all I, you know, who cares? So let's head up to the room and uh, get dressed. Yeah, I headed out to dinner, but just wanted to show a quick view. Uh, that is our room down at the end. Uh, that is uh, SeaWorld over there. Uh, and the pool area, it's like right over there. Pretty nice views up here. I mean, I don't know, it's a beautiful day. It's like 85. It's gonna be a low of, I think, 69 tonight. Like I mentioned before, we have the fireworks cruise. So we are on our way to the boardwalk, to Torrey El Forno, my uh, favorite Disney area. Oh, is you excited for uh, Thanksgiving dinner tonight or what? No one else is coming, they're taking the stairs. Are you excited? Mm -hmm. You're excited to just drink some Coke on that boat. That's what you're excited about. All right, we're at my happy place, the boardwalk. And I just want to reiterate and stress, it's the actual board, not boardwalk, not the boardwalk resort. Love the boardwalk resort area as a whole, uh, not just the boardwalk resort. But we just got here. We have about uh, 10 minutes to uh, walk inside, take the elevator down to the boardwalk area, and then um, get to Trattoria Al Forno. So we are a little excited. I know Ashley's a really excited because she's a fatty and she loves her chicken parm. Oh my, my goodness. Parm. Love this girl. Loves to eat this one. <laughs> Uh, Paxton, say hi. Paxton, say happy Thanksgiving. Where are you going now? Paxton, Haven't stopped. <laughs> Haven't stopped. So uh, yeah, let's Don't head on in that. and uh, grab dinner. Thanksgiving dinner. Oh, this is nice. Uh, 
Let's go take a look over here real quick before we take the elevator down. Wow, this is nice. Oh, wow. A little pop-up shop. Oh, wow. How cool is this? This is really cool. Those are trying to get by you. are literally just like in the way. Can you back up? No. Nope. Excuse us. Sorry about that. We're going to go this way. I love Disney during the holidays. Still no sign of Ashley and Camden. Let's see if we can find them. Where the heck did they go? Here they are, hanging out downstairs. Yeah, rolling in the grass. Kids are acting like weirdos. Uh, Packy wants to roll in the grass too. Uh, Go let him crawl around. All right, let's let him out. Go on the grass so he doesn't walk onto the cement to follow you. Awesome. All right, let's go. Here's my sandals. All right, we're here. Detroit El Forno. Let's head on in. Thank you. Ooh, it smells good in here. You guys smell that? Cannot wait to get in there. It smells fantastic. All right, we just got the menu. Unfortunately, there is a holiday plate. Uh, we got some turkey and a kid's plate, too. Um, and Nolan already said that that's what he wants. Paxton is going to have his bottle. Actually, what are you going to get? Chicken parm or are you going to get the Thanksgiving plate? I'm going to get the chicken parm. What about Camden? Camden's going to get noodles and butter. And Nolan's getting the Thanksgiving dinner? Nolan, you're getting Thanksgiving dinner, turkey? Okay. Uh, a couple of open tables. Um, not too busy, but uh, yeah, excited. All right, bread just showed up, and it came with a olive oil and garlic paste, a uh, little blend. Um, I'm curious to try it out. It looks really good. Ashley, mind um, holding that for a second so I can butter up this garlic paste. You cannot have a knife. That olive oil is so good. That's good, huh? That's a big bite. 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 Here you go. Here's the other piece. All right, say bye for now. Say bye to mom. For now? Bye. All right, we got a uh, cherry wishbone, uh, and they're gonna want to break it apart. If I know my kids, one of them is gonna be really, really upset. I say Nolan. Camden. 
One, two, three. Both got it. No. Nope, Nolan got it. No. Yeah. Yep. Because I got, I got the one that has the chicken. No, uh, Nolan got it. It has got the big one. one. I got this one. No, that was Nolan. Nolan. Okay. No, because I got the one that has the chicken. No, that's yeah, fine. This is mine. I have that one. That one's the one. What are you doing? Say hi. It was like this, Paul. It was like that. They both got it. Oh, wow. Yes, sir. Oh, my God. Who cares? They care. Who cares? Who cares? Oh, one step. One step. You're close. Oh, Axel was so close. I'm gonna uh pop into the store real quick by the, while the kids hang out and play. I tell you, I, I tell people all the time, I would much rather stay on the actual boardwalk than the uh, monorail loop. This area is just so nice, especially at night with these lights and the lake and you got Epcot over there and then uh, Hollywood Studios that way. You really can't beat this location. Uh, and it's just like so nice at night. I love it. All right, they got a couple of uh, nice little new Christmas merch. Got a Starbucks cup, $30. And then this thing. Fifty bucks. Whoa! I actually have this sweater. Uh, it says Dis I think it says Disneyland, and I bought it in California last week. Hundred bucks. Holy smokes! Oh, we got Jewish section here. Nice. Love to see the inclusion. $36.99, that's nice. Let's see what we got over here. Oh, they had these shirts in Disneyland. No price. That's nice. I like that one. We have this one. I like this one though. Looks like a uh, special edition one. And I got some other special edition ones here. Eighty bucks for the spirit jersey. What do we got on the back? Oh, would you guys pay eighty bucks for that? All right, let's head out, guys. I just love the energy on the boardwalk. It's just electric. You got all these games, all these families just walking around. Kids are winning prizes. Kids are eating snacks. 
families is just spending time together. This really Look is at just the like sunset. I know it's so beautiful tonight. Not really much of an actual sunset, but clouds look insane. Looks like mountains. Of course, it's one of our favorite resorts across the lake. The beach club. The yacht club is over there. Uh, we're going to do a quick loop uh, around the boardwalk before we head over to Contemporary for uh, Fireworks Cruise Magic Kingdom. So, and I went taking the views while we can. Walking by Jelly Rolls. And uh, they will be open tonight, but I like that they're actually opening later uh, so staff can spend time with their families. That's awesome. All right, we're here at the Grand Floridian for the fireworks cruise. I think all day I've been saying uh, contemporary because last time we stayed at Contemporary, there were uh, boats and they were like, oh, this is the boats for the fireworks cruise from Magic Kingdom. And um, I just assumed it was there. And talking to Ashley, the Disney pro. Wow, look at this. We, uh, we got an email notification to meet at the Grand Floridian between 6.30 and 6.45 uh, for the fireworks cruise. So I guess we're coming here for the fireworks cruise. Um, I do want to keep the video rolling and go in and check out the Christmas tree and the gingerbread house. This is just fantastic. We're actually staying here uh, Memorial Day weekend for Ashley and Camden's birthday. Uh, it'll be our first time staying here. But uh, man, are we excited. Look at this thing. This is 100% made of gingerbread. No, it's not. Yeah, the whole house is made of gingerbread. Yeah, the roof shingles, the walls, it's all, this is all real gingerbread. There's a lot of hidden Mickeys everywhere. Can you find any? All right, let's take a quick peek around the side. Uh, let's go loop around. <coughs> Ashley's got the kids, they're fine. What is this? Little pop-up shop. We got some treats. Look at the line on this thing. Wow. So cool. I wish. No. It is. Because you, you'll get kicked out. Because it spent, it took them a lot of time to build it. Where's mommy? Oh, let's go there. I just want to use the bathroom before we uh, load up.
All right, go ahead. Hold it. Hold it. What do I do with this? You're a trash. All right, I went to grab some ice from my cooler. Uh, you're allowed to bring your cooler with drinks on the fireworks cruises. And uh, Ashley went up ahead with the kids. I do see the pontoons with, where uh, we go, already here. Ugh, and unfortunately I found my family. Hi, Ashley. Hi, guys. What is that, a straw? Or is that from your lollipop before? It's from my lollipop. Your cake pop. I know. Mm -hmm. Hi, Ashley. Are you trying to buy me? I am, yeah. It's really dark here, so. What's going on? It's 6.45. It sounds like a duck just got eaten by an alligator. Did you hear that? Yeah. Jesus. So I was just saying in one of the previous videos how we're staying here for your birthday weekend, Memorial Day weekend. And I tell you, just walking the pool area, the splash pad, like, I'm excited. Oh my like, God, I can't wait. This has been, I mean, it's not obviously for like Christmas, like you saw the Christmas tree and the gingerbread house and all that stuff. But like, this, this is going to be awesome. I like, I can't wait time. to stay here. And it's like so convenient to Magic Kingdom and Epcot. Yeah. I'm really excited. Um, I wish it was a longer trip. Actually. I know. I see all these balconies and I'm just like, man. I wish we had more time to like night swim. And... I know. Well, we can night swim. We just, it depends on if the kids can hang or not. This one clearly can't hang. Yeah. Ooh, Daxton, he's already asleep. <laughs>
Guys, we just finished the fireworks cruise, Ashley. So Energy was just electric. I just love fireworks. I, I liked it more than the Epcot fireworks cruise. Ashley actually I like likes. Epcot more because I like when you feel like the fireworks are falling on top of you. See, and Epcot, me. like you're so close. I to felt the like I got a, a larger, like history review yes. with this one. Like and there was I, so I think this much. This was more like magical. Th there was so much information, where he was like talking about like the deserted island and like. The abandoned yeah, water park, that was cool, like, but it was also like kind of creepy because it's pitch black. Yeah. And like that whole bat area. Yeah, the bat cave. The bat Island, cave. River country. We've I got just, all that. I loved it. Anyone who loves like Disney history, I definitely recommend the um, fireworks cruise to Magic Kingdom. You get a little bit of information on the Epcot fireworks cruise. We've done two so far. First one, extremely knowledgeable. Second one, the uh, captain wasn't so knowledgeable. I was actually giving him facts from what I had learned from the first cruise. He's very quiet, which makes for a very uh, mediocre experience. But this one, what was his name? Do you remember? Bill. 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 Just moved down here a year ago from yep. what south carolina yep. 40 years in the military crushed it it's a uh turn the light on over here absolutely crushed it it was so good so knowledgeable just going around the whole lagoon uh prior to the fireworks had a fantastic spot before they started up um can't recommend it enough And uh, everyone is tired and ready to go to bed. Ah, uh, I love the grand. I was just telling Ashley, the uh, Grand Floridian has always been like the pinnacle of, I don't even know if I want to use the word wealth, but it's just been, the pinnacle of instead of like the American dream, I feel like it's like the Disney dream. Yeah. I'm so fast. I'm so fast. I don't know. I, I remember just walking in and just thinking I was just in the um, in the Titanic. It just uh, has always been such a huge milestone resort for me. We're staying here Memorial Day weekend, and I can tell you I'm excited about it. So. It's, uh, it's gonna be awesome. I can't wait to come and experience the resort. I really hope Ashley doesn't jam pack the, uh, the weekend with parks, because I really just wanna just enjoy the pools and the resort and everything that it has to offer. So off to the car and back to the hotel and Ashley made some sort of promise about some sort of arcade room. So I don't know, we'll see if the kids We'll see if the kids fall asleep on the way there and we can get out of it. All right, guys, that's going to call it for the night. Ashley took the kids, uh, the big boys, to the arcade, brought Paxton back to the room. It is 9.50. Got an early wake up tomorrow for Epcot, so i uh, going to get Paxton to bed. Get the kids prepped for uh, bed when they get home. So we will see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Thanks for following along. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel.